Hey guys, hey, how are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? Because today's Tuesday and my arthritis is killing me. It has been non-stop raining for two days and I hurt like nobody else's business. I hurt. I hurt a lot. Like a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. My mates, my joint mates do not feel good. It is bueno, you know, bueno. Um, I have severe Arthio arthritis and I hurt. Hopefully tomorrow it will not be uh, raining and then I can at least go out for my walk because being stuck in the house and not being able to get like much done it is not I'm tired, I'm sorry. It does not help. It, it actually hinders me a lot more. I'm thinking about um, just going and getting the 24 hour fitness, um, 24 hour anytime fitness, whatever uh, thing, because like between the hours of like now and you know, between usually around nine o'clock to like 12, my husband is, um, he's not ready to be home yet. And then my mother in law is in bed. So I have like, you know, two to three hours that I could be spending in that gym you know what I'm saying like and I think for military spouses they allow you to do it month by month so that means while I'm gone to go visit him I could just freeze it and bring it back the next month like you know when I come back because I don't think this is going to work out for me if I can't get out and do something every day like this is going to make me crazy so I got to hang out with Jody Olds today Hey girl, hey! I know you're probably listening to me at work, girl. Hey! I had a wonderful, fantastic time with her. She is so fucking sweet, guys. Like, you just don't know. She's a YouTube channel. Um, I will link it. Uh, she also is starting a chapter of WF, WSFLA, uh, Weight Loss Surgery Foundation of America, a chapter here. For us to kind of, you know, gather people and do stuff together and, you know, like projects and, and everything like that. Like, I love that. I love that idea. And I will insert a picture of her card if you guys want to get a hold of her. If you want to talk about what we can all get, get together and do. Um, normally, I would not participate in in the WFS, W that damn place uh, for personal reasons but because it's her and I love her like I will um, I'll participate for her uh, and and the people who are around here but as far as like we don't need to get into that and my chair just scared the shit out of me <laughs> it scared me oh, it scared me so bad no I mean I'm in a lot of pain today. Is that my husband? Yep, it is. So, Matthew's getting off work here soon, and he is going to go get the blanket that I sent him and something to eat because he is still sick. And I sent him an electric blanket so he can stay nice and warm, and that makes me so fucking happy. In this box that I sent him the last time, um, I like I put red lipstick on. It was the day of my um, that I got out of the the hospital was like the 22nd I want to say and I put these big gigantic kisses all over the envelope and I said um, these are gonna have to do until I can give you the real thing and I dumped an entire box a uh, bag of Hershey's kisses in there for him and so when he got the box he he called me he says I do not accept these kisses and I'm like what the hell are you talking about he's like I'm not gonna accept any of these kisses except for the ones on the envelope and, um, like he was eating them. He's like, I don't accept anyone ki anyone's kisses, but yours. He's like, so these, these are not your kisses. I want your kisses. And, uh, so hopefully he's looking into me, um, getting up there. Also this week I have therapy. Thank you, sweet baby Jesus. In your itty bitty, teeny tiny, a gold diaper. Because this bitch needs some <laughs> This lady, Roger, Roger, this this guy needs some fucking therapy. Yes. 
Yes, I do. I need it. I have to have it. Like we 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 need therapy. I'm I'm not doing so good in in the you know brain meats department, and it is it is something that I need to start working on uh, now. Oh, I wanted to show you guys a few things. So I bought this, which is called Run Goo for your feet. So apparently this prevents blisters, chafing, lasts all day, non-staining, works in wet and dry conditions. So it's like a really thick kind of paste that you kind of put in between your toes and on the bottom of your feet. And then you put your socks on. So I got that. And then I got these damn Quarter Pro Athlete Socks. Um, three pack. Ideal for all activities. Breathable and sweat wicking. Anti-blister zones covering heels and toes. Cooling Endurance Certified. So I bought three pairs of these damn things. Then... I bought some heel pads to prevent blisters, skid proofs, uh, shock absorbing stays in place, fits one size fits most horse shit. Um, relieves pressure and pain, uh, prevents abrasions, blisters, improves shoes to fit you better, which is what I need because those shoes are bigger. Um, yeah, so, so far I have bought a ton of stuff. For my feet and like I said the the shoes that I have are like hundred and twenty dollar shoes so I'm not what I'm not I'm not paying any more than that at the moment for another pair of shoes it's just not happening like it's not in the cards for me right now I'm not doing it like I know that everybody's like just go and go to fleet feet or go to this place and I'm like I don't have that kind of money. What I do have is I have an older pair of New Balance. It's called Rollerball. Uh, so it's got a weight in it because back when I was that heavy, my, my ankles would roll and then I would fall. Remember, I was in, in a wheelchair, so I didn't walk that much. But when I did, like I was, I ended up hurting myself a lot. So um, I have professional orthotics from them, from uh, New Balance um, in them. So now we're going to couple that up with these new socks and this fucking foot goo and some them blister shit and then the 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 little silicon thing that I put on my broke toe god almighty just to go walking. You have every excuse to stay at home. That's what you can tell yourself. You have every single solitary excuse to sit your ass at home. Or you suck it up, buttercup, and get it done anyway. Like, <laughs> I can't tell you how many days I come home with blisters and I just go walk in the next day anyway. Does it feel good? No. You know what also doesn't feel good? Gaining weight. You know what also doesn't feel good? Uh, deep vein thrombosis. No, but I'm... <laughs> I just, I don't want to be a slug. I don't want to be a log. I don't want to be, I don't want to be this anymore. Like, I want to go work out. I want, I, I really do think I'm, that's what I'm going to do is go to Anytime Fitness because I can walk to it. Um, and just go in there and go to Cardio Town and come home and carry a taser or something so I don't get beaten and chopped up. Or, it's not that far from the house. I could... I could just use her car to take me, but you never know. People are crazy town. People are crazy town. So, I need to start up in my meds now. Because I have extras before I pick up um, the stuff on, um, on Friday. So, hopefully I will get my nails fixed on Friday as well. Because they are looking looking haggard girl mm. nails be looking haggard I have not been eating that well the last two days I just haven't been eating that great um I've been eating a lot of salt I think I said that earlier so I really need to excuse me tone that down a lot this is glare on my damn glasses it's making me crazy and yeah, so that's what I need to do. Technically, I need to just 
I need to cut down on the salt because that's that's what's making me all sausage fingery. Uh, I retain salt really, really, really well, and it also just makes me feel kind of the uh, probio probiotic that I'm taking has. made my life so much easier I went from having like 89 million times in the with the issues in the description box like I was telling you to like barely anything so I am forever thankful for that damn probiotic um it is it has been a lifesaver uh, like for real it has been a lifesaver so, I don't know what I'm going to weigh on Thursday. I hope it's something good. I hope it's, I'm at least the same. Uh, I don't weigh myself every day because I'll drive myself. <laughs> Did you just yawn with me? Did you? Can you tell I'm tired? I'm turt. I'm hurting and I'm turt. Um, <sighs> having a rough day. Uh, mentally I'm just having I'm just having a rough day like I want my husband and I don't like it when he doesn't feel good and my mother-in-law is having trouble at work and it's just, it's stressors for me and I don't want to you know I can't obviously get into any of that but I'm just I'm, it stresses me out when everyone I love is stressed out and there's nothing I can do about it um, So I just have to kind of rein the salt train in. Um, it's funny because usually it'd be the the sugar train, but no, it's the salt train. I've been eating a lot of jerky. I've been eating a lot of like protein chips. I've been eating a lot of uh, salami. Da 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 da. Stuff with a lot of you know a lot of salt in it. And. Uh, So what did you guys do today? Did you do anything good? Was it raining? Is it super snowy? Did you not get out of the house? Did you watch anything good? Did you just sit like a bump on a log like me? Except for when I went to dinner. Because other than that, all I did was clean the kitchen. That was, that was about it. Uh, this video is probably incredibly boring. But I believe I am 20 days post-op. So it has been 20 days since I had my surgery. Um, as far as I know, I'm doing pretty good. I will talk about more of that later. So I love your beautiful, gorgeous, amazing faces. I hope, again, everyone had a wonderful Tuesday. And I will talk to you again tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Bye.